circuit first, I think, so you can see it better. Okay, we strip the wire, we take those wires, pass them through the thing. Right, we're doing that to give us a bit more surface area. Then this has a thick and a thin end. Pop the thin end in there. Okay, and we might put a tiny bit of tape on just to keep that there. So that gives us a nice solid stick and then what we'll do is we'll grab these the red and the black we'll grab our three volt battery the red goes to the, to the positive side with one of these little conductive stickers is quite useful it's important that you don't have the sticker or the wire over the edge we then put the black the negative down and again you just need to make sure it's centered and then we can do the sticker again and we should then have a nice glowing light okay and these are great because they will actually bend so we can keep it at that angle then it's just a matter of decorating it however you want to um sorry down for a second Okay, there's a single layer and then we just tape that on. And we could definitely leave our little flower like that if we wanted to. Or we can keep building up layers. I might go one more layer. Just try and make those shapes as interesting as possible. And then again, the tape. Okay, and that makes quite a cute little flower. Um, one hint is that if you want to put a lot of these in a vase together, because they look really good sort of as a, a combined display, uh, it can be worth actually covering the um, conductive tape and the battery, because if they touch each other, they'll short each other out. So uh, all we need to do is cover that with a bit of the paper tape, we'll insulate it. Um, And that's all we're doing is just covering it so that they don't touch each other. And um, this is like quite a pretty tape, so it's part of the decoration too. Okay, so that's our flower done.